There are so many wallets and decentralized exchanges launching at the moment for Dano and some I haven't even heard of or even knew that they were working on something. This is from the team from Vacuum Labs, the team that made Ada Lite and also wrote a lot of the code for the hardware wallets that you use on all the different wallets like uh, Daedalus or Euroi. This DEX is called Wing Grinders and their new wallet called NuFi. Yeah, yeah, gotta do it like that. You've been listening to the Learn Cardano podcast. Gotta get... If this is your first time here, please give me that thumbs up, click subscribe, click on the notification bell, and you'll hear some more really cool Cardano related content. But this is something I just stumbled across on Twitter, and I saw this from the Cardano Whale, and it's a new testnet launch of a DEX called Wing Riders. And I thought I'd check it out and see exactly what it's all about. So let's close that tab. So this is the DEX here. This is the, the brand new one called Wing Riders. And it comes with a new wallet that I hadn't heard of before, and it's called NuFi. So I'm gonna take you through the entire experience of creating a whole new wallet with NuFi, which should be very similar to what you're used to with creating other wallets in the Cardano ecosystem, and then having a little play around with the Wing Grinders decks on testnet at the moment. So let's go ahead and create a new wallet. Let's go through this process. Okay, I'll skip the hardware wallet at the moment, and I'll just call it wallet one. I'll use my suggested password from my password manager. Now this is just a test wallet, so I'll just go through this. And anything that you see here in this video won't ever be used again. It will be just be completely disregarded. So I'll just go through the process here and write this all down. Now you can see here, this is the confirm the recovery phrase section. So here they actually give you only a few blanks that you need to fill in, which is good. And it's a quick, easy drag and drop or a click to interact to fill in the spaces. Great, so that's it. So let's go to the wallet dashboard and check out exactly what's going on here. And whoa, hang on, here we go. This is a interesting aspect. Why on earth is there a soul wallet in this in this uh, in this edition here? So I've got the um, uh, Cardano Ada, which well, what I was expecting, but also Solana here. So I guess that means there is a bridge here between Solana and Ada. So that is really interesting. That one caught me off guard. Uh, looks like we have an NFT gallery section here, a staking gallery, uh, which is what you expect. You'd be able to stake your ADA. And then it looks like there's also a direct connection over to the Wing Riders decks at the same time. So, yep, I agree. Continue. Not enough collateral. Okay, okay. There's a, so there's a couple of things I need to do here. So let's go to the test faucet now. And I'm just going to go back to the decks here and see if I can connect at this point as well. Does it take me through the same experience? And it looks like it does. It forces me through to the wallet section. Okay, so go back here. Let's go. Let's go testnet. Let's copy that address. Go to the faucet and send myself some test ADA. I'm not a robot. Request the funds. There we go. So that should load up my testnet wallet with a little bit of ADA here. So I'm just going to wait a bit. So one, I have to go to the get some test ADA. Go to the testnet faucet. Copy my address, and now I need to create some collateral. So as soon as some of this uh, test ADA comes in, I'll load up my wallet with collateral, and then I'll go ahead and try and mint, mint a test token to see how this process works. Ah, right, here we go. Okay, so I've got my test ADA now in my wallet, which is good, and I'm just following the next step here. So create a collateral that was required to interact with the deck. So I'll put in the collateral here. That looks like the link. All right, so enter in my sending password, confirm that. Great, so now I have a decent amount of test ADA. I have collateral in my wallet. So let's go and mint a test token. Now they have a whole bunch of test tokens minting for me. So I'll just enter in my password again. It's interesting that they've got wrapped Bitcoin, wrapped Doge, wrapped Dot, wrapped ETH, wrapped Shiva. It's kind of telling you something, isn't it? 
Now it is taking a little while. This is testnet, so it's a little bit slower, I think. And great, so that took a little while, but finally got through, so I'll dismiss that. So I have, assuming now I have a whole bunch of other test assets, well, I'll just go back to my, whoa, there we go. Just go back to my wallet and I can see them all there. This is really cool. It's, uh, I really like the idea of seeing wrapped assets on a Cardano wallet. Okay, so let's now start so let's now start with the swapping process. So here I have, I've clicked on swap and I'll put in, let's say 100 ADA and I'll swap it for another asset. So I can see all the other assets here and let's swap it for some wrapped Doge. There we go. Uh, amount, I get almost a thousand. Let's submit that transaction. Enter in my wallet password and confirm. Let's see how this goes. Great, that was quite fast that was good to see and let me just check so uh, let's see here active expired swap request so that's the request so that will go through at some point in time so while that happens let's add some liquidity to a particular pool and I have some ADA and dots in my wallet so let's add to this liquidity can I add yep create a pool I can't add to an existing one so let's create a new liquidity pool Add liquidity, I'll add some ADA, let's say another 100 ADA. And I'll put in, yeah, I'll, I'll work with Doge at the moment. There we go. That looks good to me. And let's add liquidity. Is there any slippage? Oh, there we go. There's a tolerance, 5% slippage, timeout. Great. Okay, submit. And I'll add in the password again. And there we go. So now that's my transaction submitted. Let's dismiss that. And I can see now my uh, request is there. Great. That seems quite straightforward and quite easy. Uh, it's, uh, it's very nice. So I can see my swap request has gone through as well. So if I go back to my portfolio, I should so active liquidity request. Yeah. Okay, cool. Um, now, what did I swap again? I swapped more Doge, didn't I? So I should have more Doge in my wallet. Uh, there it is. I wish I remembered exactly how much I had before it so I can check. Uh, maybe I can check my account history. There we go. Okay, so I, I started with that. that. I'm assuming that was my very first initial balance. Then I transferred and bought some more. And then this would be the extra that I put into the liquidity pool afterwards. This is great. The first impressions, this is an absolutely fantastic DEX and a really, really good wallet. I, the user interface is very intuitive. I literally, this is the first time I've seen this wallet and seen this DEX. I'm just stepping through it and having my first impressions of it. And so far it's really good. The fact that I can navigate around intuitively and try and guess where things are is a really, really good thing. I found a lot of the features that I needed to do, testing the transactions and actually looking up the history to find out if any of this stuff works. So I'm really impressed with that. So Wing Riders DEX, absolutely fantastic from what I've seen so far. It's a trustworthy team. The fact that it's powered by Vacuum Labs, the same team that has written all of the code for all of these little devices, and of course, I can't find my Legend Nano. I always go into a panic when, I, when this happens. There it is there. So these devices, they wrote the code so that it would connect to all the other wallets, connect to Daedalus, connect to uh, Euroi. So if you're using a hardware wallet, this is the team that bought it for you, that made it possible. So think about that. So I'm pretty excited about this one here. So if you want to find out more and learn more about it, you can check it out at wingriders.com. You can check out the brand new wallet at new.fi and you can join their Discord and follow the project, learn a little bit more about it. It's all on testnet at the moment. So this is all just uh, going through the final stages before they launch on the final platform on mainnet. So if you have any issues, please report it to the teams. This is when they need the feedback the most. All right. 
This is an absolute fantastic uh, development. I'm really excited about this one. So I'm gonna have a little bit more of a play and please leave a comment down below. Tell me what you think. I would love to hear your thoughts as well. So uh, I'm pretty excited. I'm gonna have a play now. Yeah, yeah, gotta do it like that. You've been listening to the Learn Cardano podcast. Gotta get it hype. Crypto is what we like. But this is not investment or financial advice. Gotta do your research, cause it's risky. We know it is. This show is educational and it's informative. Crypto's the future, really, it ain't no debate.